Hi, this is Francesca Monaco with the Blackboard Learn product team. Today I'm going to show you the new social learning tools available in Blackboard Learn. And just a quick note that your institution will decide if and when to enable these features in your Blackboard environment. So we've worked with over a thousand students and educators to develop a set of social learning tools that allow you to discover, connect, communicate, and collaborate with a global learning network of Blackboard users. And to get to these new tools, you simply go to the navigation menu. Now when you have the social learning tools available to you, you'll see that you have an enhanced profile that not only includes your picture, area of study, and about me description, but also includes a profile wall so you can communicate with your learning network about your classes, extracurricular activities, and academic interests. And if you go to the Edit Profile screen, you can see that you have multiple privacy options for your profile. You can make it available to all Blackboard users, which includes people at your school as well as people at other Blackboard schools. You can make it available just to people at your institution or just to your classmates, or you can keep it hidden from everyone. Now that you have this profile, you're going to want to find and view profiles of other people. So that's where the Enhanced People tool comes in. The People tool enables you to discover and expand your learning network. And your learning network consists of everyone you have some sort of connection with. So for example, anyone who you're in a course with or anyone you're following. Now the ability to follow is a new feature that's part of the social learning tool set. You can simply click on follow from any profile card or you can click into a person's full profile and click follow here. Once you're following them, you can view their profile posts and comment on them. And their profile posts will appear in your posts tool, so you always stay up to date on the conversations going on across your learning network. Now if I go back to the people tool, I can click on my institution, Monument University, to view the Monument University directory, as well as who is in each of my classes and organizations. With the new social learning capabilities, I can also search the global learning network of all Blackboard Learn users by clicking on All Profiles. So you can build your own learning network right here within Blackboard. Now that you can discover and build your learning network and communicate through your profile wall, you may also want to communicate in a more private way. That's where messages come in. You can communicate with anyone in your network by sending a direct message to them from their profile card or profile and you can also send a message to one or multiple people by going to the Messages tool. This is also where you reply to messages and manage all your messages. Finally, in addition to communicating with your learning network, you also need a way to collaborate with others in your network, and that's where spaces come in. You can create a space for things like a study group, a group project you're working on, an interest group, a team, anything you want, and you can create a space in less than a minute. Simply click Create a Space, give it a name, and invite people. And if you want, you can also change the privacy setting of the space. By default, a new space will be protected, which means that anyone can search for the space, but they need to request to join or be invited to join. You can also choose to make it available for all Blackboard users to join, or make it private so only people who are invited can see and join the space. You can also give your space a picture, description, and assign it to a category. And spaces have a wall for communication and collaboration. Any posts to this wall will show up in your posts tool, so you never miss a thing. Now you can also join a space by viewing all the spaces that have been created at your institution, or you can view all the spaces that have been created across the global learning network, which are broken down by category. So as you can see, the social learning tools in Blackboard Learn allow you to discover, connect, and collaborate with your global learning network right within the learning environment you visit every day. That wraps up this quick hit video. You can find me on Twitter, or check out some of my other videos. Thanks for listening.